Hey everyone, Jared Shaffron here, the voice of the South Carolina Stingrays, coming to you with a new Arenas of the ECHL video. This is the first time for the South Carolina Stingrays in Rapid City, South Dakota, the home of the Rush, the Rushmore Plaza Civic Center. As you can see right here, a great, great facility. A little bit smaller than some of the other ECHL facilities. Coming in at just over 5,000 is the seating capacity. And uh, they have a great sign here, welcome to Rush Nation. Over here is the Bank West Club, which we'll be checking out in a little bit. But as you can see, great facility. The suites are on the far side. There's a uh, wall with a video board here on this side of the rink. And we're coming to you right from where the press box area is. Great view of the game here in the press box. This is where I sit. That's my computer right there. On the other end, the voice of the rush, Mark Benetti. And uh, here's this, this wall on this side, the off-ice officials who do the stats and the scoring for the game will sit right behind me and this table out back. And excited to show you a lot about this facility, which actually is a multi-purpose facility. And there's other events that can be held here as well. So we'll get into that in a little bit. Now down at ice level here, the Rushmore Plaza Civic Center. Through these doors are both locker rooms for both the Rush and the Stingrays. The Stingrays are located just behind this door. They come out this door and walk right down this hallway here at ice level to get onto the ice. The Rush enter in a different door. The Stingrays go right through this area, right onto the ice. And we'll take you right in here so you can see where the Rush enter the ice it's a little bit of a different spot the rush enter down here to the right of that subway dasher that path goes out to the rush locker room and right onto the ice still at ice level here one of the main concourses in the arena a lot of fans coming through these hallways in this specific hallway when they enter a rapid city rush game you can see the this is one of the doors to go outside. Here's one of the pubs where you can grab a drink, the Enforcer Pub. Good little tabletop bar spot that you can grab a drink at right near the seats here on the, on the concourse level. As we continue on the concourse, another sampling of some of the food you can get here at the games. A lot of tables, a lot of options. Very busy and packed concourse when the doors are open. Uh, a lot of different oppor opportunities for different food. And here we see the Rush Team Store as well. well. Let's try to get a look at some of the items in here. Different merchandise that the Rapid City Rush have for the fans. Now up on a suite level here. We talked about this earlier, the Bank West Club. On the suite level, great, great spot in this arena. Maybe the best spot to sit down, grab a drink, meet some, meet some friends, and right on the end of the ice. So you're looking this way at the game, but a lot of seating in here. There's obviously seats in front of me here, but also just a lot of space, good location, and some great different kinds of beer that you can try out as well. Some local options, but they've got everything. And this is a main bar right here that gets pretty flooded during the game. We mentioned it's a multi-purpose facility. Well, they've got plenty of events coming up. And this hallway connects everything here in the building. A lot of different events going on, different catering banquet halls. There's concerts, fine arts, performances and everything kind of connects through. The hockey arena is down this hallway to the right. And we'll kind of show you a little bit more of everything that's connected in this building. Now down on the main floor of the Don Barnett Arena, which has seen many concerts. Everything started in this building in 1977. The first ever concert here was Elvis Presley. And they've continued a tradition of having some great acts and great music in this building as you can see the seats kind of go up there it gets a little dark up there but they're uh, they're setting up right now for a skillet concert the stage is up the band has not loaded in yet but just an idea of how this looks 
our final stop outside the administration offices and box office here for the arena. You can see the Elvis started off in 77, KISS, and then it continues many photos and videos all throughout this hallway of all of the performers that have been here over the years. That's it for today's tour of the Rushmore Plaza Civic Center. Here from the parking lot, you can see obviously how big this building is. A lot going on here. Great spot for the residents of Rapid City. And maybe we'll get a look here at you can see some of the mountains in the background. There's some of the mountains in the background. Right near this facility. Thanks for tuning in.